If you want to see how Ziki compares to traditional command shells, you may like the video below better than this one. We've all seen movie scenes showing computer users typing commands into a dark screen, getting information and making all kinds of things happen with just a few keystrokes. This powerful way of using computers is called the command line, and it's been used all over the world ever since the 1970s. The time has come for the command line to go to the next level. It's time for a command revolution. Introducing Ziki. Ziki breaks down barriers and brings the incredible power of shell commands to everyone, making commands friendly and fun, even for inexperienced users. And Ziki's main goal is to be the command shell of choice for experienced shell users and programmers. This is a bold claim, but stay tuned and I think you'll be convinced. Ziki is a new kind of command shell where anything can be a command. Traditional shells allow only one kind of command. Ziki breaks down this barrier. In Ziki, anything can be a command, including shell commands, URLs, phone numbers, tweets, email addresses, music notes, code, files and directories, keyboard shortcuts, git commits, unit tests, and hundreds of others. And you can define your own. Ziki breaks down another important barrier. With traditional shells, you can only run commands using the keyboard. In Ziki, you can also run commands with a mouse, in a web or mobile browser, right from a text editor or IDE, and you can interact with command output, similar to how we interact with menu items. Advanced users can use Ziki in a traditional shell console, where you can do everything using the keyboard, including interact with command output. Let's see Ziki in action. With a Ziki plugin for your text editor or IDE, you can just type commands and run them in place. When you're learning, right-click a command to see examples to start out with. This command renames many files at once. Type Control Enter to run the command. When running Ziki in a shell console, you can type Control D to use a text version of the exact same dropdown. Ziki comes with all kinds of commands built in. You can do fun stuff like type music notes to play them. I'm going to show you a lot of examples pretty quickly, so hold on to your seats. You can pass multiple lines to a command by indenting two spaces. Filter command output by typing XIKI or whatever text you want to filter to, and use commands that interact with the web browser. Ziki combines the power of text interfaces with the friendliness of graphical interfaces, giving commands friendly interfaces with immense power. You can type tweets and send them, view your Twitter followers, type phone numbers to send text messages, and type email addresses to send emails. The last two commands use Twilio and Gmail behind the scenes, Type a dollar sign to make a shell prompt. You can run and rerun commands by moving the cursor around and typing Control Enter, or by double clicking with the mouse. You can type HTML and CSS and try it out in the browser as you go. Ziki gives advanced shell users unheard of speed and efficiency. With traditional command lines, after a command is in running, it just sits there unresponsive, no matter what you try to do to it or to its output. This is the third barrier Ziki breaks down. Type Control Enter to drill into and expand a command's output and use it like an interactive interface. You can also type directory paths to navigate files. To do things like delete and rename, type Control D or right click. Ziki turns the output of commands into slick interactive interfaces that you can navigate with a keyboard or the mouse. No need to type multiple commands or copy and paste arguments. For quickly trying out new libraries like Bootstrap and 3JS, Ziki is unbeatable. At any point, you can save your commands to a text file, then open the file later and run the commands again, or give the file to someone else so they can run the commands. Everything in Ziki is just text, so you can add notes anywhere you want. This blurs the lines between just typing commands and creating usable interfaces. Hi, I'm Nick, and I've been using Ziki for five years. Hi, I'm Keith, and I've been using Ziki for seven years. I'm Craig, I've been evolving Ziki for over a decade. I've done talks about Ziki at the Strange Loop, QCon, and RubyConf conferences, and many user groups. I'll keep showing you examples while I talk. I've poured a big fraction of my life into Ziki. Because I believe in it, and I think it's something that the world needs, by backing this Kickstarter campaign, you'll make it possible for me to spend the time I need to bring a new version of Ziki to the world. Much friendlier installer and initial user experience, with Ziki plugins for Sublime and Vim, and other text editors and IDEs. I believe open and flexible formats are the best thing for the tech ecosystem. Since everything in Ziki is just plain text with some optional coloring, it's almost trivial to create your own commands. Just drop a txt file into the commands directory in your home directory, and you've created a command. Or create commands with Ruby, JavaScript, or Python files, or many other file types. Ziki is UI boiled down to its absolute essence. The use cases of Ziki go from a better way to run shell commands, to making interactive notes, to software development, and rapid prototyping. If you're a fan of open and flexible technology that ties things together, back this Kickstarter campaign, and together we'll bring the command revolution to the world.